When school let out for the weekend on Friday, Aiden Fucci was a 14-year-old student at Patriot Oats Academy. On Monday, he was behind bars charged with the murder of a 13-year-old classmate. Aiden Fucci and Tristan Bailey were both students at the same K-8 school in St. Augustine, Florida, and they also lived in the same neighborhood in St. Johns County, Florida. Less than one month ago, 13-year-old cheerleader Tristan Bailey was barely enjoying the start of her teenage years. On Mother's Day, May 9, 2021, her body was discovered at a nearby pond less than half a mile from the murder suspect's home with a total of 114 stab wounds. The discovery was made by a neighbor who was out for a walk at around 6 p.m., roughly eight hours after Bailey's family called 911 to report her missing. The Florida team responsible for the murder will be tried as an adult after he allegedly attacked his victim so viciously that the knife's blade broke off in her skull. Aiden has been in custody at the Department of Juvenile Justice Facility in Daytona Beach since his arrest on May 10, 2021. The day after Tristan was found dead, authorities arrested Aiden and charged him with second-degree murder. Of the 114 stab wounds, 49 appeared to be defensive wounds to the girl's hands, arms, and head as she sought to fight off her attacker. A broken knife believed to be the suspect's was found in a pond near Bailey's body. He indicated to his classmates that he was going to kill someone by taking them into the woods and stabbing them to death weeks prior to Tristan's murder, and DNA from the victim was found on the suspect's clothing. Oddly enough, it appears Tristan's death was a case of being in the wrong place at the wrong time since Aiden had no motive to specifically target the 13-year-old cheerleader. Pair's classmates told news outlets the two were friends but were not in a relationship with each other. In a shameless move from the troubled teen, Aiden posted a selfie to social media on May 9th while flashing a peace sign from the back of a police vehicle. A representative with the sheriff's office said the suspect took the photo while Bailey was still missing and he was only considered a witness to the case. He created the post on Snapchat with the caption, Hey guys, has anyone seen Tristan lately? Facetiously written over his selfie. If convicted, Aiden could face up to life in prison, but because of his age, he is not eligible for the death penalty. His mental health is going to be tested to see if he's competent enough to stand trial. If he is not mentally competent, he will be sent to a mental health facility until he's ready to stand trial. Prosecuting attorneys feel confident that the case would end with a murder conviction and a life sentence for the 14-year-old Florida teen. According to the arrest report, deputies found a security video that showed the two teens walking east on Suburban Street at approximately 1.45 a.m. on May 9, 2021. The video later showed just one person believed to be Aiden Fucci holding a pair of shoes while walking west at about 3.27 a.m. Authorities believe that Fucci killed Bailey in that window of time and left her body in the woods.